Hey guys, it's Ginger. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm finally getting to a video that is long overdue. I've been meaning to swatch all of my Madame Glams for you guys for a really long time and I finally got it done. <laughs> so <clears throat> I have separated this video um, not by color, so I'm not doing like pinks, blues, purples. I'm doing it more by collection and then towards the end I'll do it more by color. So the first collection I'm starting off with is the cat eye collection and I want every single one of the cat eyes that they have because they are all absolutely stunning. <laughs> so um, I decided to voice over um, this whole process just to uh, be able to give you a better description of the color and if it's not showing up on camera quite the way it is in real life I will let you know. That way you get the best um, description and idea of what these colors are going to really be like in real life so you know what they look like before you buy them and this color oh my god is stunning so now with the cat eyes there is um you can put a black base coat down and with some of them that does work really well for instance carmelito here works really great with a black base coat because it is just a little bit on the sheer side and just a little um, but most of these cat eyes are very opaque and I find that I put one coat down of the color of the cat eye and then another coat and then pull the cat eye with the magnet and it works absolutely perfect. This is the way I do all of them. I don't put a black base down for any of them and for the most part I find that it really doesn't make that much of a difference. Um, so I do have more swatch videos um, in my Madam Glam playlist. If you want to go check those out, I have swatched some of these before already, but I needed to swatch them for work, so I recorded the entire process so you guys can watch all the colors that I have. Um, I would say all in one place, but I am going to break this video up into about three videos, maybe more, just so they're not so long. And yeah, so, <laughs> um, and if at any time it's going by a little too fast, just feel free to pause the video and take a closer look. I did speed this up. I didn't want the video to be too awful long. So, you know, if you need a better look at the color and I didn't quite hold it up to the screen long enough, just pause the video, take a good look, and there you go. <laughs> so, <clears throat> um, yes, these cat eyes are stunning. I love them so much. So I'm gonna let you watch this for a minute and I'll be back with you. Okay guys, so up next are the Platinum Collection and the Diamond Collection. Now on the website, the swatches that they have look very similar, um, but these collections are very different and I'm going to show you that right now. So this is the Platinum Collection and these things twinkle and sparkle and they are just so beautiful, but they are more on the sheer side and I think that these ones would make a really great like glitter fade or a glitter topper over a similar color but even after three coats they're still not completely opaque so I did go ahead and do three coats of these uh, of each of these uh, platinum collection just to try to build up the color as much as I can so that way you know you can see it 
um, but I, I wouldn't use this just on its own. It, this definitely needs underwear. <laughs> Even if you did white under it and then did like a glitter fade, it would be stunning. So, so pretty. So yeah, that's just a little bit, um, a little bit on the sheer side for these ones, but still a beautiful sparkle to it. Okay, so this next collection coming up is the Diamond Collection. Now this one is a lot different. Um, it's a lot more opaque and a little bit on the thicker side. And they are so stunning. I would compare these to, if you've seen the potted gels, the Vetro, like the gold leaf and the silver leaf, those are what this reminds me of. Because they have that silver leaf kind of in it and they're so beautiful. And these are what I call hand grabbers <laughs> because they just, they really catch your attention and people will be grabbing your hand to get a closer look at how gorgeous these are because they're stunning. And the last one I do is called Berry Girl. Now it is not berry at all. It doesn't have like a pink or a red or any kind of berry color to it. It's more of a caramel color and it shows up pretty true on camera. So, um, but it's, it's been one of my most popular colors for this collection. And I would love to get the full collection of this one as well because they're stunning. So that is it for this video, guys. Please stay tuned. I am gonna have the rest of the videos up as soon as possible. If not the same day, it'll be the very next day. Um, so look back for that and hopefully I can get this done in about three videos and they won't be too long for you guys to watch. And if you have any requests for future videos, please let me know in the comments below. I want to thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!